This is the Ford Transit Custom Sport 320L DCIV. DCIV stands for double cabin van. So not only do you get a handy load space at the rear, you also get extra seating. But that's all well and good, but how does it go with a decent load on board? Well, that's what we're here to find out, so stick around. For even more details on this vehicle, make sure you read my full written review at the Cars Guide website. And if you're watching this video on YouTube, make sure you hit like, share it with your mates, subscribe and tap that bell icon to stay up to date with all of our content. The Ford Transit Custom Sport 320L DCIV has a 2.0-litre four-cylinder turbo diesel engine, a six-speed automatic transmission and its front-wheel drive. It has an 8-inch multimedia touchscreen with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, AEB blind spot monitoring, adaptive cruise control and a reversing camera. The black metallic exterior paint is a $650 option and this van also has those rather distinctive racing stripes and it wears 17-inch alloy wheels but it has a steel spare. And remember, for all the pricing details, read my full written review on the Cars Guide website. Load space dimensions are up on screen now and the 3.5 cubic metre area looks like it's able to cop work duties with tie down points, protective wood panelling and rear lighting inside. Let's have a quick look at this van's load capacities. This van has a listed maximum payload of 969 kilograms, a brake tone capacity of 1,800 kilograms and a gross vehicle mass of 3,200 kilograms. Remember, when you're hauling a load and or towing, always keep well under your vehicle's load capacities, and that will ensure you'll always stay legal and more importantly, you'll stay safe. All of the elements that make the Ford Transit such a nice work vehicle to drive when it's unladen carry over to when you throw 800 kilograms in the back. That engine and transmission are generally a nice combination and work really well. You're never hunting for the right gear. Engine braking is somewhat compromised, but that's to be expected because it is a smaller capacity engine and that only ever happens on steeper downhill sections. Steering is fine, it's nicely well weighted and that suspension does a really good job of keeping everything settled and composed and that's a nice surprise because it's just a traditional rear leaf spring setup. From the moment you climb into this Ford Transit, it is a very easy work vehicle to get used to and to spend long hours in and that's important because this is your mobile office. It is no surprise that the Ford Transit has through the years garnered such a rock solid reputation as a work vehicle. It really is nice and it's a great combination of functionality and ergonomics and comfort. There's a lot of comfort here to be had. The official fuel consumption figure for this van is 7.3 litres per 100 kilometres and that's on a combined cycle. Our actual on-test fuel consumption figures which take into account our loaded loop are on screen now. This van has a 72 litre fuel tank and a 21 litre add blue tank. It has a five-year unlimited kilometre warranty. Ford Transits have always made a lot of sense as light commercial vans. They are functional, they are comfortable and they are convenient for drivers and passengers. In terms of usage as a daily driver, it is exceptional and when it comes to load carrying abilities, it passes with flying colours there as well. And the bonus here is that in double cab guys, it really does add an element of versatility to its people and load carrying ability. For even more detail on this vehicle, make sure you read my full written review at the Cars God website. And if you're watching this video on YouTube, hit like, share it with your mates, subscribe, and tap that bell icon to stay up to date with all of our content.